Okay, so let's go back to our spreadsheet. The days that we're looking at here is September 10th, and this graph here represents the downstairs by the thermostat, and the one under is the upstairs common area, and so on. On the 10th, the high that day was 92 degrees, and the low was 64 degrees. The humidity levels range from 88 to 29 percent. Let's take a look at the downstairs real quick. You can see that the dead band, or the temperature's highs and lows, is ranging about 4 degrees. And at the lowest temperature points, it's hitting around 70 degrees. And at the highest temperature points, it's hitting around 75 degrees. So about a 5 degree swing on this day. The humidity levels are maintaining around 53%. Now let's take a look at the upstairs common area. We can see that the lowest temperature point got to around 69 degrees. And at the high point, around 77 degrees. So we're looking at around an 8 degree swing throughout the day. The humidity levels go up around 55% on both days. And down around 48% humidity. So around a 7% fluctuation in humidity. Now let's take a look at my bedroom. We're not going to worry about the humidity levels in this room. Because this spike right here, I'm pretty sure somebody was taking a shower. And didn't turn on the fart fans. And you can see at some points throughout the day, the temperature swing is only around 2 degrees. And that's because we're running a fan in that room. And the temperatures range from 70 degrees all the way up to around 75 degrees. So around a 5 degree split overall. Now let's take a look at my daughter's room where we're having all the trouble. She would complain all the time about how hot her room would get. And I was like, eh, it can't be that bad. Now I realize that she was sleeping in a torture chamber because the temperatures were ranging from 71 degrees all the way up to 80 degrees. So around a 9 degree difference throughout the day. And the humidity levels are ranging from 55% all the way down to 45%, which is a 10% swing throughout the day. And the reason why her temperature splits are around 1.5 degrees is because she's running two fans in her room. Her overhead fan runs on high, and she has another fan directly on her. So it's like a whirlwind in there mixing up all the air. That's why the temperature splits aren't that big. Now let's take a look at my son's room. And he's not running a fan in his room, so he's coming out to around a 4 degree split. And his temperatures range all the way down to 68 degrees, all the way up to 76 degrees. So a 6 degree swing throughout the day.